hello friends today i am going to solve jumping on the cloud problem in this problem what we have to do we have given one area and uh, we have to find how much time or how much step we will take to go from first index of array to last index of array right for example if we will take uh, this this example okay so zero one one let's let's say example this is our array array values of array right so let's put a index of that array zero one two three four five six so what question is saying that question is saying that how much step we will take to uh, how much step or how much jump we will take to go from starting of this uh, array to last index so if you will see uh, in example they have mentioned at a time we can take only uh, uh, only two right two step at a time before uh, we, we cannot take more than two step at a time right so we can take less than two it means we can take one step or two step but we cannot take more than two step at a time so suppose we will start from index zero right we need to check how much a step we are going to take to uh, jump at last position right so if index one two six we can go index zero to six at a time but we cannot do because in question say that we can take more only uh, more than uh, we cannot take more than two jump at a time so if we will jump one zero to six it's, it's take one two three four five six a step at a time but we cannot take we can we can take only one or two jump at a time so what we will do we will jump zero to one this will take one suppose this will take one jump right we again we will try to jump zero to one but because we cannot jump zero to one right because one here if you'll see we cannot jump index one to two, two because the value of index two is one and which index value is one we cannot jump on that clouds uh, right so what we will need to do we need to jump one to three so if we jump one to three it's take another jump right it's take a and then we will jump three to four it's take one jump and we will, we cannot jump four to five right we cannot jump four to five because five index of five value is one so what we will do we will jump four to six and we will reach at we will reach at our destination so how much uh, step we have taken we have taken so four step right in this uh, we will question will be we have we, we need four. to find minimum step how much we can take so for checking minimum state uh, let's see we will uh, start from light here in this example we have taken a starting from taking one step at a time so now this time we will try to take two step at a time so that we can uh, reduce the total number of jumps so suppose we will try to jump zero to two zero index to two but uh, index of two is value one so we cannot jump it so we will go zero to one it's take one step again we will not direct jump one to two we will go one to three it's also take one step and we will again we will try to jump three to five but it's uh, have one five at five so we will reduce one jump we will go three to four it's take four uh, sorry it takes one more step and again we will mm, try to jump four to six we will go four to six so it's taking uh, next time so in this situation is taking four four jump right so this is uh, for in this scenario we have higher jump is also four and lower jump is also four so we have to mm, give lower jump so it will be four will be also lower and higher jump so we have to return four in this case if you will see an example you will see here zero one one if you will go for this example here yeah they also return four if we will go for this example right uh, four zero one zero right if we will go for this example zero 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 one and zero i uh, suppose index is zero one two three four five so what we will do we will start from jumping here zero two we will directly jump to uh, so we will directly jump to index so it's when we will reach here it will take one jump right again we will go from two to four but we cannot go to four because for four value of four index is one so we will take one less step we will go two to three it's take one step and we will again then we will go three to five right so it's take three step right if we are taking uh, two step at a time suppose let's 
if we start taking one step at a time so what we will do we will go 0 to 1 it will take one step we will again go 1 to 2 it will take another one step and we will go again 2 to 3 it will take another one step and we cannot go 3 to 4 because value of 4 index is 1 so we will go 3 to 5 so it's take 4 step and 3 step so minimum step is 3 so we have to return this value of this 3 right so if example you will see yeah result is 3 so let's do program for it so what we need to do uh, if in this program you will find right let's begin uh, if you will see here this is function right jumping on cloud function and we have to this function return one integer value you can see so we have to return that total number of jump we need to take so we will create one variable so that variable can count come jump so int jump it will be a start from zero and now we have to check right uh, suppose if and what we have to do first we will try jump two step at a time right then if we, it will not allow to jump two step because of this value a one then we will take one step so we will check if uh, array name is c sorry we have first we have to start loop so that we can travel the start to end so we will row four int i is equal to zero i is less than c dot length and i plus plus and now here we will check right if c of i plus two we will take uh we will jump two step at a time if i plus 2 is equals 1 is not equals 1 right not equals 1 because if suppose here if you see if we will jump here from here 3 uh, 2 to 4 right index 2 to 4 it's take 1 so we cannot jump here right if it is allowed 0 uh, 0 to 2 and value of 2 is not 1 then we will go and we will increase count our jump so here we will ju jump here put we will jump plus plus and because of uh, if you will see when we jump here we are not going to check this uh, this index right so we will increment value of i also right and else case else case right if this is not true right else case if you will check else this if here we have to jump two to four and it's five value of four is one then what we will do we will not jump here we will just go two to three right so we will in increment here in this case we just increment our jump and we will not increment count sorry no we will not increment i value right uh, so it's fine if we will run let's see but we have also to check this thing okay uh, we have to focus about uh, area out of bound, bound index also suppose here suppose any case we are coming here right our index is one and what here we are going to do we are checking index i plus two right c of i plus two if our index will be four uh, any scenario and we will check four plus two right so we will check area of six but uh, in this case it will arise uh, array out of bound exception so we have to also focus this if suppose we will reach at this position right it will only for uh, generate array out of bound exception when i our uh, i will be at this position right suppose here uh, our i will be at this position so what we will do we will just take one step so we have also to write condition for it so we will put this all in if our i is uh, greater than c dot length minus 2 right we will check if our i is greater than c minus 2 sorry less than c minus 2 we will check less than c minus 2 then what we have to do again we will write this one this condition or we will put here and else case else what we will do we will increase jump right 
let's run this code mm, return a statement sorry and we have in last we have to return jump right so after loop this is our loop here i will return jump run. okay it's uh, going here new yeah, output output is going five okay okay sorry yeah uh, if you also see that here here if we will reach here we don't need to go uh, actually we don't need to ch because here we are checking right if you will see in last position we are directly going there so we don't need to run our loop to till last length right so it's automatically increases so we need to decrease the jump one yeah you can see our both cases as pass let's submit this code yeah it's run thank you so much